must save her. My daughter. How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some more Breath of the Wild for you guys today as always. Hope you're all having a fantastic day wherever you might be. Ooh, look at that. Way up there there's actually a shrine at the top of that mountain. I kind of want to go do that, but we might, we're going to do this shrine that's right in front of us first. So, hope you guys are all having a fantastic day. Uh, we ended the episode last time right here. Oh look, it even kept our, our Cryotus. And Epona is right over there, too. I wonder if she'll be able to, to go all the way around. Oh. Oh, she got pretty close. Alright, well, anyways. Magda here. Doesn't want us to step on her flowers. She worked very hard to plant these flowers. She's going for hybrid species. And, uh, or hybrid breeds or whatever. So we gotta be very careful that we don't step on these flowers or she will get very angry. Okay. No! You must not hurt the flowers. They are screaming out in pain. I didn't even do it. I was like, why did the game just stop? Oh, okay. Okay. They're screaming out in pain. I apologize, but... I'm pretty sure I didn't touch the flower. Maybe I did. We ain't messing around this time. Oops. <laughs> How many times do I have to say it? Please treat the flowers with care. They're living things, you know. Oh my gosh. She's getting terrifying. So I can't hurt the monsters. Or the flowers, so maybe I gotta use my halberd. This will allow me to, to poke without slicing, right? This one's already dead. Oh, I want that gardening, uh, that tool right there. All right, we're doing good. We're doing good, except my uh, my rusty halberd broke. All right, I think we got it, boys. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. There's one flower in the middle. Oh yeah, <laughs> that was so close. <laughs> oh man, they put one flower in the middle. Can you imagine if you went the whole way and then you hit that flower in the middle? Hmm. Taking a sip of my caramel iced coffee. Watch out for the flowers. Complete. Hopefully this is one of those shrines that, that's just like, Congratulations! Here's a chest and a, and a spirit orb. You don't have to do anything. Just by getting to the shrine, you, you've you already earned your reward. Hopefully it's one of those. Let's see. Okay, it's not. Alright. This one we're actually going to have to work. This one's called drifting. Alright. Oh. So if I just like put that right there, it'll just stop it and I can go across. But I didn't even need to stop it. Do I even need to like actually use these pieces of wood? Or can I just... Cryo Cryonis my entire way. Oh, look at that. There's actually a chest down there. Oh, yeah, boys and girls. One chest down. Oh, oh. hopefully there's Are there any other chests in here. Hopefully there's more than just this one. Interesting. Alright, there's a chest right there. There's also some explosive barrels. 
I think I'm about to, I'm about to have that bomb just drift with the barrel. You know what I'm saying? And then for this chest, we're going to go ahead and uh, pop it up right over here. <coughs> just waiting. Alright, that bomb is getting pretty close. We're going to detonate. Are you kidding me? It didn't even detonate the big one. I guess I could still get through there, huh? Alright, where's the chest? Wait, where'd the chest go? Wait. Where'd the... Oh, I blew it up and it dropped ice arrows. I didn't know you could blow up that chest. Alright, I mean, it's not exactly what I was trying to do, but... Alright, maybe I, maybe I could do it better here. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. Oh, that's it? That's it? Alright, wait, wait a minute. Check behind. Alright, we're good. Alright, that's pretty easy. Not too hard, not too hard. We're making good progress already on this episode, guys! Already got a shrine! Oh, look how cool his pose is. He's like holding that ring, levitate style. Levitating style. Thank you, thank you for that spirit orb. Oh, we need one more spirit orb, guys, and we get another heart piece. May the goddess smile upon you. Sometimes I like to, to watch the cutscenes. Bow goblins are omnivores? They, oh, they enjoy meat, fish, and also apples? Alright, so I'm assuming I still can't walk on the flowers. Oh my gosh. She's so mad. So many times. I've lost count of how many times I've told you. It's just so many now. How do you not understand? Why don't you get it? I work day after day after day to plant those flowers. Then you go <coughs> <coughs> Oh my gosh, this poor lady. Excuse me. Like, you did way more damage than I did, lady. I will make you understand. Wait. <coughs> the flowers rage! <laughs> Alright. Oh, she brought me down to one heart? How dare you? You don't know who you're messing with, lady. Yeah, that's what you get. Alright. Um, let's see. Where's Epona? Epona, you're on the wrong side of this river. Do you understand that? But I will come to you. Have no fear, my faithful steed. Wait. There we go. Opponent, I'm coming! There we go. Alright, I'm like dying. I just want to get rid of this uh, notification thing. There we go. Alright. What do we have over there? I have no weapon equipped.
Hey, maybe I'll get something for like, wow, 25 damage on that bow. All right, now that I'm getting attacked by guys, I kind of need to eat. See ya. Could I, uh... Another strength that strength in this little bowl. Dude. And a chest? Is that girl getting attacked again? Oh, that's a nice spear. Hold up. Definitely taking that spear. Alright, lady, come here. I like watching the river flow by. Is that such a crime? Seeing the water stream so peacefully makes it hard to believe that the Great Calamity really happened. Wait, really? I like her outfit. Very casual and nice. Mm. Then monsters attack out of nowhere. Then I think, oh right, time to head back to the stables. Wow. Ugh, whatever. Wow. Nothing, uh, not, not gonna give me anything for saving you or anything like that? Yep. Oh, come here, come here, no, 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 come here, bud, come, hey, hey! Come here, come, come, come! Got him, we got him! What, you scared of this thing? This little guy? He ain't nothing but a little bugger. Look, oh, there's another dude right there. Hey, what are you doing by my horse, dude? Who are you? Spoon? I've never been there myself, but they say there's a spirit called Nadra at the Spring of Wisdom. They say it looks like a dragon. But like I said, I've never been there myself, so I wouldn't know. Wow, alright, thank you for that awesome information. Feeling woozy? What? No, I feel quite fine, sir. Thank you very much. Alright guys, let's go to the blue marker on our map because that is the next uh, tower that we need to be ascending. And it's on the way to where we're trying to go. There's probably so many things that we could explore and adventure here, but... Man, that hill looks awesome with all those trees. Ooh, a Boko camp. A big Boko camp. Oh man, they're sleeping too. We might t we might take advantage of the fact that they're sleeping. You know what I'm saying? We might have to take advantage of this. Took a, took a couple arrows, but we got it. Hmm. I might be able to kill them with just like, uh... I oh, will use this. That works. Did I wake up anybody else? No, I didn't. Oh, it just started the rain. I was gonna... Ah, uh, well, whatever. Um, how about this? We're gonna drop this right on the sleeping dude to see how much damage it does. Alright. Two white ones. Stop regenerating. 
Your health. These guys are strong, but now that we have better weapons, it's actually so much easier. Where are you going, dude? How are we, how am I not getting these headshots? Okay. What? Are you kidding me? Alright, you're not the only one that can do that. Drop the weapon, sir. Alright, let's loot this camp up. Blackened crab. Hey, first time we got a blue rupee. All the way up and down. I'll take the money and the arrows. Very nice. Roasted bass. Another arrow, some more money, some more bass. Some chests over here. Wait, what? Let's try that again. Oh yeah, five arrows. Oh, this uh, this one we actually need to break with the uh, sledge. Beautiful. Look at that couple chests right here, just chilling. Amber. All right, that's actually like the cheapest one, but I'll take it. Think there's any guys in the Skull Rock? Poor little bugger. Never stood a chance. Alright. Oops. Well, that's one way to do it. Surprise! Oh, I can't use bomb arrows in the rain. Feels bad. And there's a Pona right on time. Oh boy. Sorry, Pona, but this is not a good time. That's a nice weapon. Hmm. What? Oh my gosh, she actually killed me. Please tell me I don't have to re-kill all those guys over again because that would be terrible. <laughs> right? Usually they stay dead, I'm pretty sure. So it'll respawn me, but they'll stay dead. Yeah. I didn't mean to whistle. Oh look, all the boxes are still here again. Oh my goodness. So I gotta oh no, they're all empty now, right? Yeah. They they respawn the boxes, but they're all empty. Very interesting. Let's just make sure. Yeah, they are. Weird. However, we could use these. If I'm very careful. We can use these uh, strategically, as it were. And since we have our uh, rain right now, it's like covering my footsteps so they don't hear me. What I'm thinking is, we'll blow them up inside, and then they'll come out, and we'll blow them up again. You know what I'm saying? Alright, here goes nothing. Hmm. 
Yeah, let's just do both. Alright. Here they come. Here they come. No? Hey, dummies. I'm out here. Hey, dummies. I'm out here. Come on. Come on. There you go. There you go. There you go. Got one. <laughs> oh, you're dead. You really can't see me when I'm that close. Nice try. That's what you get for killing me earlier. Oh, you broke that barrel and you released the slime. Bye-bye. We're gonna chuck that and take the broadsword. Alright, were they hiding anything in here or was that just for nothing, basically? Basically for nothing. There's not even a treasure chest or anything. Oh well. No biggie. Still worth clearing out. We got a lot of items to sell. Epona, get over here. I need you. Man, it is raining too. Absolutely downpouring right now. Uh, we could find a fire to rest at. That would be nice. Let's make it across the marshlands here. Can I go get up there, Apoda? Come on, baby, you can do it. Oh yeah, oh yeah. What's up? What's this tower up here? We're gonna pay a visit to this guy. I see those guys. There's there's some boxes there. Might be worth getting the breaking the boxes just to get the arrows if there's any inside. But I'm thinking we don't even have to fight those guys. If I'm if I'm kinda quick. No, I'm not gonna fight you guys, sorry. Uh, oh. Whoa. <clears throat> Let's push him in the water. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's dead. Actually. I could just like... Look at those froggies. Dueling Peaks Tower, guys. Soldier's bow is badly damaged. Oh no. We're going up. 
I think if my memory is right, oh boy, we can get the uh, the climber's armor, one piece of it, in the shrine that's up ahead. Gotta save my stamina on this tower. Can't just jump in too much. All right, there we go. Look at Epona just chilling there with the boat goblins. They don't even mess with her. They know that she would just kick him right off the cliff. That one guy's looking for his buddy. Oh, look at her. She's kicking him. Yeah, Epona. Oh, my goodness. He doesn't even seem to mind. She's just going crazy. Oh, my gosh. Oh, there she goes. That's my girl. Alright guys, we made it! Our third tower, Dueling Peaks. In the downpouring rain. If you're wondering, the weather effects in this game are just pretty much random, so... It could be sunny when you play it at this time. It could be raining. It could be windy. You know, it's just different for everybody. Scanning area. I believe this will put Kakarko Village on the map. Oh, yeah. At least now we can see a little bit more. And I could warp here if I ever need to. How are we doing on time? We got a few more minutes here. Can I jump to that? Yes, yes I can. Oh, this one's gonna be close. Dr. Ox are like, oh my! And they can't do anything. Whoa, that's a nice shield, man. Way better than my pot lid, for sure. All right, um, let's see. I do want to get that shrine that's right up here, but first let's get these uh, these mining nodes. Ooh, rock salt. No, 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 stop climbing. There you go. Yes, yes, Link, I know there's a shrine very close. Maybe we have enough time to do that shrine. Let's see. I'm gonna try to get there really quick. No, 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 stop climbing. I think the shrine is right around here. Boom! Re Dahi Shrine. One more shrine before we say goodbye for this episode. I think this is the shrine where we can get a piece of climbing gear, but I could be wrong. Aim at your feet to create a pillar of ice. Yeah. Hopefully this is not a hard one. Timing is critical. Okay. That was pretty easy. I believe we want to use stasis at some point up here to get the chest. This is a fun little shrine though, I remember this one. Alright, so we want to go. We want to go like that. 
right? Whoa, buddy. And then for this one, this one's where we get a little tricky. We want to go... Zoop. But then we also want to go... Like this. We're going to freeze the button here. Go. 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 Easy. Yeah, buddy! We got the climber's bandana. Oh, that's an equip now. That actually uh, ups our armor from four to seven. Almost doubles our armor as well. And I look stylish. Oh yeah, this shrine was definitely worth. Man, those they put those barrels there just to mess with you. They don't act you don't actually need them at all. And we got four spirit orbs, guys. You know what that means. When we get to Kakariko Village, boom, we're getting another heart piece. Easiest shrine of my life. May the goddess smile upon you. Well, what? I only died once this episode, so that's pretty good. Hopefully I have enough money to buy an armor set once we get to the village. Which will definitely be next episode, guys. Which also, since this is episode 9... Oh, it just stopped raiding too. Uh, since this is episode 9, that means next episode is episode 10. And every 10th episode, I'm going to do a 1 hour special. So, next episode should be really fun, guys. Thank you so much for the support you guys have been giving me on this series. I'm really, really enjoying it. And I love reading all of your guys' comments as well. Um, yeah, I don't think there's much over there. So, I think we're going to stop it right here. Uh, we're going to continue on next episode down this path and see what we find. Thank you, guys. And as always, this is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next episode. Take it easy, guys.